for the audience, I am reenacting how I woke up this morning. It's not that early in the morning, but it's kind of early for me because my alarm didn't go off at the right time. So I don't normally get up this late. I kind of get up around 7-ish, kind of make it up at 8 so I can start getting some things done. Try to turn on my Xbox. And apparently it is broken. Fuck. It's always something. I don't know why y'all, but I love getting different kinds of oil. See, I got, I got coconut oil, black castor oil. This is, all of this is a must, you know what I'm saying? For like anybody with her, even just people, even people with skin, like I know, even people with skin, even like black people, you know what I'm saying? Or even white people, like you can, y'all can get all of this and it'll be good for y'all skin too. Peppermint oil, that, that smells good. If you put that in your hair, like if you have, like, you know, it's, it's for sure, for sure, yeah. And then boom, I got my hemp oil. Oh uh, yeah, for sure, man, that's a must. Uh, put that on your skin, like right after you get out of the shower and shit like that, I promise. And like 15, 20 years, your skin to thank you, man. And you gonna thank me, so. Don't, no, but you could thank me right now. You could subscribe for sure. Oh, yes. You could thank me right now. You could subscribe. That's for my Xbox not working. That's for my Xbox. <laughs> What? I know some people do not brush their tongue. That is nasty. So much bacteria on your tongue, especially sitting from last night. Y'all need to brush your tongue. That's why y'all breath be smelling like doo doo particles and shit. Cause y'all ain't brush your tongue. Be having bad breath is not gonna stop me. Cause I have a big day. I'm not gonna let that Xbox stop me. Cause I have a big day today. Understand me? Boy, if you don't get Hey, this shit is fire. It's off my new album. Hold on, I'm gonna take y'all so y'all can hear it. To my home and I never should invite her Cause now she push my buttons like a fucking typewriter All she do is lie to me, lie to me All she do is lie to me, lie to me Call you queen bitch, or maybe just bitch Play with me, I'm like an experiment like Stitch 626, numbers in your phone And I tried to save your feeling, the feeling harder than chrome My heart breaks, shattered to pieces, it's no stress The feeling real heavy, I pull it like four flex Straight to your mama house so she can cuss me out Like the summary of a book, bitch you know what I'm about See your friends hate me, your sister hate me, your mom hate me I don't even know why you wanna date me Boy, I'm finna drop some heat. I'm telling y'all, y'all better check it out. Look, if y'all wanna check it out, Q U I Z Z Y T V. It's Quizzy TV. Oh my god, that shit is gonna be lit, man. Y'all gotta check it out right now, okay? Y'all wanna see something dope? See, dope shit. Also, one thing, boom, I love this right here. So I'm headed to a business meeting real quick. One thing that I like is this, like, y'all see this? It's the king chess piece, you know what I'm saying? I always keep that around me. Every time I do business, if I have to put anything on there, why? Boom, 
you y'all gotta get creative if you a music artist or you do anything with music or anything get creative with your craft get creative with your stuff because bro when i tell you that it this is a conversational piece you put that on the table people are like why you had that boom wow. plug it in they like okay this dude got something going on so i'm just saying that's i'm just giving y'all a tip like hey look if whatever you do get creative with your shit you know what i'm saying because people People don't always remember. It's always somebody doing YouTube. It's always somebody being a music artist. It's always somebody selling clothes, selling lashes, selling whatever. So I'm saying, when I, this is what I'm saying. If you're going to do that, which, you know, ain't nothing wrong with doing that, then try to figure out a way for you to be different from other people. So that way people could stick in their head. They, that you going to stick in their head. It might be one single thing. It might be this chest piece that make you stick in somebody's head. Then, boom, you know what I'm saying? They giving you an opportunity or, boom, y'all working together and y'all make multi-million dollars this is the first step you know what i'm saying you always got to take a step and you always got to be different that's why everybody challenges you i'm gonna challenge you you what i'm gonna challenge all of y'all all my subscribers and the people that haven't subscribed if you haven't subscribed go down below and subscribe right now but i'm gonna challenge all of y'all to be different you know what i'm saying no corny shit no cap yeah i always decided to put on some business clothes you hear me basically what i'm doing today is I'm going to meet this uh, this woman, um, really nice woman. It's for my business, you know what I'm saying. So I feel very good, man. Like I feel I feel very good to finally reveal what the hell I've been working on because boy, it has been a motherfucker to try to lie. I've been trying to put some stuff together, and so y'all might want to know what I actually do. I'm like, all right, okay, okay, I get it, I get it, I get it. And I, I'm gonna reveal that in a second, man. I promise. I'm, I promise. I'm gonna let y'all know. You know what I'm saying. The time is nearly right. I'm headed to a coffee shop. You know what I'm saying? I don't even like to drink coffee, you know what I'm saying? But I'm definitely going, I'm gonna get like a few other things while I'm there. But man, like I said, it's been a long time coming. Like I definitely, I definitely know that I've been working hard for this. Everything that I've been doing has been leading up to me getting my own. Like me working at other companies, working with other people, we, me, you know what I'm saying, struggling, trying to, trying to, like, like, quitting good jobs and shit like that. Everything that I've been doing has been leading up to me doing my own thing, having my own business, and that's what's the most important. No, boy, get your Aladdin feet looking ass. No, boy, pointy shoe ass. Pete, Peter Pan foot ass. Boy, I'm finna get on your shit. Boy, them ain't fucking shoes. Them is fucking wafers. Nasty ass, boy. I should not be recording on the highway. Oh, uh, nah. What, what you want to race? What you want to race? Actually. Oh, hold on. Let me hurry up. Oh, shit. Don't crush me. Don't crush me. Please. What? What you say, boy? You want to race? Oh, okay. That's what I thought. You gone. That's what I thought. Please. If your city don't have an Ikea in it, you ain't popping. Like, y'all ain't popping. If your city don't have a fucking Ikea, y'all is not fucking popping. Like, my city got an Ikea. Like, hold on, man. Y'all city don't have these flags? Hold on. You see these flags? If your city ain't got no Ikea, it ain't popping. St. Louis is popping. Fuck you thought, bro. Apparently, they say this the one of the best places to go out and, and get some do business, you feel me? 12.30. He said he got you. So yeah, I've been trying to, what I've been trying to do is like drink more water because you know, we are, I'm on, I'm doing the 30 day water challenge, like 30 day water, but then it's also like no sugar. So like I almost bought like a coffee, but I'm like, y'all gotta help me stick with this, bro. Y'all really gotta help me. Dream Properties LLC. <laughs> See? Dream Properties LLC. Like I said, man, we do a whole bunch. Of, look, what we do for you: we clean, gas communication, restock essentials, problems and resolution, property maintenance, and business concepts. So I really know 
that y'all really want to know what I actually been doing. So right now, uh, don't mind me. Right now, I'm just on the business call right before we start the meeting. And so, you know, I said, I just want to uh, make sure that I actually chat with this client real quick. Um, but the reason why I like to do it in uh, the coffee shop, and, and in fact, it's, it's really good business advice for y'all is because it's an open area. It, it breeds uh, positivity. It also produces like a mindset that you have that is like, hey, look, that because you want to actually get like some business done. So it's like promoting a healthy mindset of being there. And it's also around like minded people. So you can go anywhere that you might want to have a business meeting just make sure that it's around like-minded people because that that breeds something for you to grow off of so i will be um kind of breaking down the business and the end i got two phones one from the oh wait, wait, wait okay so this is not that this is not that type of video okay now you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, just stay, stay tuned and, and like and subscribe if you haven't, man. It helps me out for real, for real, for sure. Ooh. So, y'all. So, just got done with the uh, the meeting. Meeting went great. She is a lovely woman. You know what I'm saying? Uh, we got a lot of things that we just, we just talked about. Um, you know what I'm saying? Go over a lot of details. You know, the biggest thing is when you're doing business, you always want to find common ground. Like you always want to make sure that you and everything that you're doing can coincide with exactly what they're doing and y'all can meet in the middle of that. So that's the biggest thing. That's one of the biggest things that you would do when you're doing business. You know what I'm saying? You always got to make sure you do that. Y'all, I just retwisted my hair and now I got to retwist that shit again. You know what I'm saying? We definitely got something going. I'm just, I'm doing videos and everything. Like we got this interview that's getting ready to drop. I'm getting ready to drop this on my other channel with featuring my boy Low Man he from St. Louis. He an artist. He a music artist. We did a video. I shot and I edited that. And man, when I tell you, it's dope. And I just want to say, hey, my co-host. This is my co-host over there. I, if I zoom in, it'll, it'll hold on. Maybe maybe I can zoom in. In my, anyway, her little greasy head ass. The reason why I fuck with her is because not only does she have a business and she's helping me with mine, is she just like every she's TTG for everything that I need. Like she 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 made this whole little flyer right here and it looks dope. Like look at that, look at that, look at that. You know what I'm saying? Like that's dope. You know what I'm saying? Can't draw for shit though. Look at that paint. Can't draw for shit. That girl drew a germ. Nasty ass. Talking about I wish anybody would say my pick ugly. Yo shit is ugly as fuck. I, I definitely drew a better picture than her. Y'all, look where I'm at. Five guys, you hear me? Hey y'all, I ain't gonna lie. I had to do a little celebration. So I went to five guys. I don't always go here because you know what I'm saying? It do be a little fattening. It do be a little fattening, but I've been working out, getting my shit together. So, you know, I definitely had to come back over here and, had to get something, you know what I'm saying? Hey, look, I, I fuck with this place. You know what I'm saying? Shit. Fuck a Chick-fil-A. You gonna get the five guys today. So yeah, pretty much I started a business. The meeting that I just left out of went really well. Uh, it's my first client that I've actually added on. Like I said before, I can we convert long-term rentals into short-term rentals. So I do Airbnb, do the initial setup costs. We do the management, how we run, we manage the cleaners. I manage everything. So basically it's called, uh, it's what they call co-host. And I'm gonna bring y'all every step of the way. You know what I'm saying? Every step of the way, I'm gonna bring y'all there. Y'all like, you know, quizzy, you know what I'm saying? Is the channel gonna be about this? Is it gonna be about that? Really the channel is just about the things that I like to do It's like the pranks, the vlogs, the business, that's all a part of me. So that's what I do in there. I, I just, I give y'all me, you know what I'm saying? I'm giving it back to you so that way you can take that and you can run with it. Like Usain Bolt, like anything that I get, I'm gonna tell y'all about, you know what I'm saying? Like that's why I opened up and told y'all about the biz. Classes was just so much money. Uh, I ended up reaching out to a pretty cool, cool YouTuber. He's, um, he's from the Midwest as well, but, um, I don't know if he got too busy or whatever. I, I was never able to get like a message back. All I would have to say is if you got something, if you want to make some shit happen for real, for real in your life, the biggest thing is y'all got to stop saying, I'm going to wait till tomorrow. I'm going to wait till next week, bro. Do it today. And I know that shit It's like, remember what I was saying about the Everest commercial and shit like that. I'm not being cheesy. I'm telling y'all, man, look, do that shit. 
today, bro. Stop waiting. Like, you don't want to wait on nobody because, no offense to bro, but let's just say by the time, you know, he was able to get back in contact with me or by the time it would have been a good time for him or anybody else, just anybody else, who knows? Like, you know what I'm saying? I got to think about my family. I got to think about the things that I got to do. So what I'm going to say is, and definitely get people's opinions definitely uh do your research and then also be be wise and the way how you could be wise is literally by learning from other people's mistakes not yours you being smart be wise you know what i'm saying and so i mean definitely do that but at the end of the day don't be afraid to go hit the ground running don't be afraid to make mistakes like you know what i'm saying they made mistakes other people made mistakes and guess what you're still gonna make mistakes if you're scared of making mistakes you ain't gonna get nowhere bro i promise to god like i made so many mistakes like little shit turned into bigger shit and with just this business with being a music artist and being uh and 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 acting all types of stuff jobs i've did a lot of that but guess what dog I've learned from so many things. It's made me a better person and it's also helped me progress and shit like that. So let that shit, let the mistakes help you progress. You feel me? Like let it straight help you because it will get you where you need to go. And then you know that if you ever get down bad to the bottom, you know how to build yourself up. That's a valuable tool. It's something on the screen. Hold on. See, I knew it was dirt on the lens again. That's what always what happened. When it be dirt on the lens, then it be looking like it's another background, but it, it's not. I was in the studio the whole time. 2018, I stopped myself. 2019, I stopped myself. I was in a horrible just a relationship. I just need to get out of that. 2020, I, the world stopped me. But I still didn't let it, I didn't let it keep me down. I still was doing shit. 2021, it's my time. It's your time, let's go, okay? It's our time, I believe that. I promise you that. We are gonna get that shit together. It's the first step. I'm, I'm making it happen, you know what I'm saying? Dream Properties, LLC, I'm making it happen. I can't wait to start vlogging about this more, man. All right, y'all, I'm not gonna keep y'all here for too long, but I started a business. Y'all been wanting to know what it is. This is the business. More YouTube videos on the way, more music on the way. We dropping more music. I got an album coming out in two months. We're gonna do it big, we're gonna do it crazy. We got some old pranks on the way. Everything coming, it's everything. It's full speed ahead, it ain't no stopping. It ain't slowing down. I can't never slow down, I would never slow down. I would never stop the grind. We always gonna keep hustling, we always gonna work harder, and we gonna get it, we gonna get it together. Why, because we the motherfucking dynasty. You the dynasty, I'm the dynasty. We're all part of the dynasty, we're a family. We gonna do this together. It's Stream Saturday every Saturday at 10 p.m. Central Pacific Time, all right? And guess what? It's watching Wednesdays where I drop reaction videos on Wednesday, and you're gonna get pranks, and you're gonna get regular videos, and you're gonna get videos on how to be a millionaire. You're gonna get all of that shit. And guess what? I'm doing that shit for y'all. I'm doing that shit for me. Thank you for supporting me. I love y'all. Baby, I'm moving so low. And my eyes look so low. I cannot trust no hoe. I'm a dog like Toto.